Good afternoon and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here this afternoon with Barry and Delilah. What we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is Delilah's ability to understand and respond to her obedience commands. The corrections and the motivation that we give the dogs when we're working with them and the training equipment that we're using. Barry's using a regular six foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of that leash folded neatly in his right hand. That leaves the left hand free to give the correction and the only correction that we give here at school is a little tug and release on the training collar and that is the second piece of equipment that we're using and you'll be taught how to use that correctly on your lesson when Delilah goes home. Now she's sitting very nicely at Barry's left which is where all of our obedience training is done and the first exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is healing. The command is Delilah heal and at this point her job is to stay even with your left leg not dragging you down the street but walking nicely paying attention to what you're doing and each time that you stop your feet she has been taught to sit automatically without being told to wait for her next command. So this makes walking Delilah a pleasure and she is a nervous high strung dog, very high energy so the calmer you can keep yourself the better it is for her. Now the next exercise that we're going to demonstrate stay. is the stay. The stay is a hand end of voice command. Barry uses the left open flat of his palm about an inch or so from her muzzle and the one word firm command to stay. When Barry returns back to her, he walks all the way around her, returning all the way back around to heel position as an added distraction. And each time that you return to your dog's shoulders, she expects to get another command. And Barry gave her some praise for a good job, and they're going to run through their heel and their sit and their stay again for us. So this healing, if you want to walk very slowly and chat, she should stay with you. If you are a fast walker or power walker, she should walk with you as well. She should always match her pace to yours. If you change direction, she should be right there at your heel. And when you stop, nice automatic sit. And Barry's going to leave her in another stay. And the next exercise that we're going to demonstrate for you is the recall or the come on command. You use her name and a happy voice. Well, come she comes her. right in front and she should sit facing your knees and that eliminates her jumping all over you. And then Barry has her return back to heel position, back to always back to where they started, always back to heel. And he's going to leave her in another sit, stay. Stay. And we'll demonstrate that recall exercise again for you. Come, go girl. Praises are in. Coming to you should always be a happy event as long as she's not coming and jumping all over you. And a nice automatic sit. Now we're going to demonstrate for you our down commands. We have down from heel. Now she's at heel position. Barry's going to use his left open palm straight down toward the ground and the one word command stay. to down and he leaves her in a stay and your sit stay and your down stay are considered stationary exercises the long down stay is for three to five minutes and it helps to develop her attention span her focus and her maturity which was what she was lacking when Barry returns back to her he will walk all the way around her again the way he did on the sit stay all the way back around to where he started at heel. He praises her up and then they're going to show us that down from a heel one more time. She's a very smart girl and she needs this mental stimulation. Down. Stay. And we're going to be coaching you and teaching you how to use these commands indoors as well as outdoors that's very important to be able to now speak to your dog in commands and this time Barry will call her out of this exercise Hello, come. she's anticipating he knew he, she was gonna, he was going to call her and then she returns back to heel and now we're going to set up for our down from a distance Barry's going to leave stay. her on a sit stay he walks out to the end of the training leash He's going to use his right hand to give the command and drop her into a down from six feet away. 
Down. Perfect. Set. And now Barry will drop the leash. Set. And we don't want you to even start to try to do this in the beginning. We want you to get her doing all of her commands on leash for you first. But this is the beginning of intermediate training where she still has the leash on but there's no one on the other end of it and she's very aware of that. She remains lying down until Barry gets all the way back to heel position and he praises her. Now we've demonstrated for you your heel, your automatic sit, your stay, your down, your down from a distance and your come. These are the exercises that you're going to practice with her at home. You're going to incorporate them into your everyday living situations. I think that you're going to see a world of difference in your girl. We've enjoyed having her, and thank you for choosing Nora's Dog Training Company.